Summer outside, it's the perfect time to relax and enjoy some tea. But next time, instead of buying just an ordinary tea blend, try making your own with some simple ingredients. Chelsea Bersiaga from the Natural Products Network is here to show us how to do it today. And better for you, you're making it from scratch right, here. Yes, you can save money and do something very healthy. Okay, Absolutely. well, you've got some plants here on the okay, end. Okay, so yeah, so my first point is look to your garden. You don't have to use dried herbs, you could use fresh herbs from your garden. Wonderful. So things like mint and lemon basil taste really great together. You want to tear the leaves a little bit when you, before you put it into the hot okay. water to activate the flavors. Use about four cups of water, take a handful of each of the um, er, fresh herbs you're using and then you're going to simmer for about 15 minutes. And that's it? And, that's and you it. can grow these inside too if you don't you have an outdoor garden. You can grow them inside. Be careful of mint if you plant it outside because it will take over a space. Oh, which is so nice though. <laughs> Just gives you more yes. of a reason to cook with it, right? Yes, definitely. Okay, so fresh and then what are you talking about here? This okay, is special so this tea? is um, rooibos and I brought it in because it's a cafe caffeine free tea but it still gives you a lot of energy and vitality. So what people are doing is they're making a rooibos latte. So you just take some like I have here, brew some up. So you're buying the bag here. Yes, or you can buy it in bulk like what I have uh -huh. up here. And then you just take some almond milk so and So similar like you in. would a normal tea and then yes. you're just adding almond milk to this. Yes, and you get okay. a wonderful latte. And then I have some vanilla beans up here in the front here. You can add some vanilla to um, spice it up a little bit And you more. bought the real thing there The too. real thing. It tastes fantastic. Check and it out. And you buy it in this form and then cut it up? Yes, and then you just take the little seeds out of this part of the, the I've pod. I've never known how to use that. And then you don't throw these pods away. You can use them to flavor sugar. So you wash the pot out, that then put great. it into some sugar, and you can have some vanilla sugar. Okay, I'll let you move on to the next thing while I try your <laughs> almond milk <laughs> rooibos latte. Yes, yes. So then I have some hibiscus mm -hmm. here. So that's this good. is something that's a little bit of tropical for the parties. Okay. So brew up some hibiscus. Then I have some cinnamon sticks. You can put them into flavor. They really complement the, the tartness in the hibiscus. And then add some agave Wonderful. to it. Yes, and if Very it's an adult easy. party, Try um, adding a little bit of vodka or that tequila. Sounds great. Yeah. That sounds really good. Okay, you've got colorful mix here. Okay, so this is where you take some, you start with some English breakfast tea, uh -huh. like what I have here. And you're going to brew just like a bag or two of that. And again, four cups of water. Add some basil to it. Again, tear the leaves to activate the flavors. So you're going to simmer that for about 15 minutes. Then you're going to add some agave to that about I would say two tablespoons of agave uh -huh. and then let that sit for a while cut up some strawberries put that in um, and then you're going to drain it after it cools to about room temperature and I actually cut up some more strawberries to put in the, the very end of these but you can make these wonderful popsicles yeah they're very refreshing oh that's terrific Aren't those good? In the summer? That's yummy. In the summer, something mm, different that you can do. Mm -hmm. Sounds so good. Yeah, strawberry I, and basil go great together. You, when you're brewing your own tea, do you just, do you simmer the dried leaves like this and then strain it in something special? I, I don't use anything special. Do you just put special. it down like in a tea ball or something Right, in yeah, there? you can put it in a tea ball or you can, you, you know, I have a big strainer that you can strain it out, whatever's easiest for you. A lot of gadgets that work for that. Yeah, yeah definitely. Chelsea, thank you. Very good ideas today. I know, I'm like thirsty now. <laughs> and it's great on a hot day too. It's yeah. the cool tea. You can find more information, by the way, in the on air section of our website, kwgn.com. Click on the link to the Natural Products Network. It is 826 now and we have the latest.